Hey guys, Kai here. I sound so sick. There's one next to my floor. Huge mirror. <laughs> um, you won't need that for work. Anyways, uh, this is gonna be a get ready with me for work edition. I don't really do much. Um, I'm a very natural person. I don't. I did not prepare for this at all. I just sort of sat down and I was gonna get ready and it's like, hey, like, anyways, we're just gonna use a brown mix shade for the eyeliner on the bottom and then I'm gonna try to find my black the eyeliner on the top. Is this it? Yes. So this is the next eyeliner in the shade Brown Perfection. Stay on and definitely a turn on. It's <clears throat> it's been used a bit. <clears throat> so I'm just gonna put this on the bottom lash line. Uh whenever I get paid, I wanna order a white eyeliner. Just I feel like you need to be angled more this way. It's not really gonna work. Anyways, sorry, you just won't see this. I just I like wearing eyeliner on my waterline and my tight line because it makes your your eyelashes look fuller to me and then this one is just the Ulta Beauty gel eyeliner in the shade blackout and then I'm going to put that on my top lash line can you guys see that? I have purple in my nose I don't know from what god my skin is so dry by amount of moisturizer so that's fun Yay. Cool. And then I have to find my <laughs> uh not eyeshadow. Not eyeshadow. Not mascara yet. Um, I'm gonna go in with the Milani Earthly Elements palette. Does it say the name shades? No, it does not. So I'm just going to go in with <clears throat> that shade right there, as I lose my voice completely, <clears throat> on the Luxie 207 brush. And I'm just going to lightly cover my lid with it to give it some color and definition. <clears throat> I wash my brushes. And it, it's loose now, so, I mean, I think it survived like two washes and then it just, it's done for. I'm trying to stay far back <laughs> enough that you guys can see, but like, I don't have my glasses on so I can't see. I feel like this one's lighter. So I don't have that brush, but now I want <clears throat> this brush. It's the Glam Beauty. It doesn't have a number or anything, but it's just like a small angle brush <clears throat> to do on the lower line, the lower lash line. Okay, so this is it so far. I went ahead and smoked the bottom lash line out, and then I added some lip balm. Hey, my camera's dying again. <laughs> cool. Fun. Hi. I'm back. Oh, I need to turn this light on. My camera died. My hair is no longer in the towel. And I completely don't think I should on it. And I'm gonna put my lip balm on because my lips are too <gasps> I don't know if I've made this joke yet because it's been a while I've been sure my camera, but uh... Jeffree Star, can't we have Okay, we're gonna do highlighter first. I knew what you needed With this brush, I have no idea what brush this is. It's a, oh my god, I can't read cursive. It looks like 
Miss Glam L36 or something? I don't know. Anyways, uh, yeah. Ulta has one that looks just like this, and I really want to order it and compare it because this is the Wet n Wild, Wild Rainbow Highlighter and Unicorn Glow. And I really want to order Ulta's. Scare the crap out of me. I have to go to work, so I'm trying to stay out of the purples and the blues. Let's go for the more natural. Oh my god, I found a lip scrub. After I put the lip balm on. <laughs> cool. Okay, so the mascara I use is the Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara. This is not the waterproof one. I don't really wear waterproof stuff unless it's on my waterliner tight end. And to just keep this look more natural and not so crazy looking, I'm just going to stay like at the lash line and not really yeah, pull it out that much.
here guys because if not i will literally keep messing with it forever probably gonna get a picture for instagram and then call it good i didn't grow like any other short pieces at all so let's get a picture for instagram I didn't have that light on the entire time. Cool. Do I want to do just my camera or snatch it? Oh, it looks weird with glasses. Ugh.